We are back in London for another luxury shopping vlog. I am so glad you are here because in today's video we are back in London and we are going to be going to Harrods today. It's been a while since I've done a vlog in Harrods so I'm super excited but before we do that guys I am now heading to the V&A, the Victorian Albert Museum and we are going to be taking a look at the Chanel exhibition and we're going to be meeting some fellow YouTubers but I have quite a few videos in store for you over the next few days so tomorrow oh i'm filming it tomorrow we're coming out in a few days time we will be going to selfridges and meeting quite a few more youtubers we are all getting together so that is going to be super exciting and then i'm hoping i do get time to go around the pre-love shops here in london so we can take a look at some pre-love hopefully bargain finds now in terms of being here in london is there anything that i'm looking to purchase um to be honest i'm super tempted to get a mini celine 16 but I still kind of want to see how mine holds up. So I have the small size here in black leather and I kind of just want to give it a few more months and just see what the wear and tear is like over those few months before I do decide to get another one. We are going to be heading to Fendi at Selfridges tomorrow. So I'm excited to see some of their new range. Their catwalk came out yesterday at the time that I am filming this. Let me know in the comments down below if there's anything that you like the look of throughout today's video and also if you like this style of video. Okay, slightly out of breath. We've got a fast walk on right now. Uh, behind me here is the Victoria and Albert Museum. It is the most beautiful building. And if you are in London and haven't been, I highly recommend it if they've got a good exhibition on. Uh, I'm not sure how long the Chanel one is on for now, but it is literally about a five to 10 minute walk from Harrods down the road here. So really not that far at all. Okay, let's head into the exhibition. This is the building. How stunning is this? And we've got a beautiful blue sky here as well. Here it is. It looks like we've got a bit of a queue going on, so we'll see how long it takes to get in. The exhibition is all about the history of Gabrielle Chanel. It is the first UK exhibition dedicated to the work of Coco Chanel, charting the establishment of the house of Chanel as we know it today and the evolution of her iconic design and style, which still influences the way that we dress today. The exhibition is on until the 25th of February, 2024. It is now fully sold out. The only way you can get access to this is to become a V&A member. So you would pay a fee uh, for the year or if you know a member, they can take someone along with them for free under that membership. And you can get up close and personal with some of these spectacular pieces and just see the detail that has gone into them. This coat has to be a favorite. After bags, guys, coats are my thing. This is incredible. If you are a lover of Chanel, I just found the most wonderful room with all these incredible Chanel designs just everywhere, all over the walls. Some of the original 2.55 bags designed by Gabrielle Chanel herself in February 1955. You can see the crumpled lambskin, the Mademoiselle Turnlock. In 1957, Chanel designed the sling back shoe to elongate the leg. We also have these quilted evening bags made from silk and satin, red, black, beige, Here we are in this mirrored room. It was probably the most spectacular room whilst we were there. Look at these pieces, these incredible dresses. All the embroidered detail was out of this world. Oh, this gold dress. This is so beautiful, like ball gown. The exhibition was incredible at the V&A and I did promise that we were meeting some other YouTubers and here they are. We have Hi. Claire and Hannah. Hello. Guys, Hi. do you want to tell us what your YouTube channel is? I will link these down below by the way. I'm Hannah and my channel is So Much Design with Hannah. Hi, I'm Claire and my channel is Claire Louise Lux. <laughs> 
I love your channels, guys. How, what did you think of the V&A, the Chanel? It was brilliant. Exhibition. It was really recommend that. Stunning. Yeah. Yeah. Did you have a favourite piece? I think probably the room at the end was my favourite overall. Yeah. But then obviously the lovely uh, Chanel bag that we the that. The reissue. <laughs> the the reissue. Yeah, that was gorgeous. The lambskin, I think, was Yeah, yeah. fantastic. Yeah. <laughs> Amazing. Right, okay, we're going to head to Harrods now. And uh, as mentioned, guys, make sure you are subscribed because coming up the next video, we are meeting even more YouTubers tomorrow. Mm -hmm. yeah. And we're going to be heading to Fendi <laughs> and Selfridges, and it's just going to be great fun. Going to be amazing. <laughs> okay, so here we are at Harrods, but I do have a confession to make. I ran out of time filming the other day, so it's a few days later, but it's fine because this is going to be seamless. But we do have a new guest with us now. We have Nick with us. <laughs> Hello, um, Nick. This is going to be the first video coming out of this like mini series. Mm -hmm. So we're doing Harrods yeah. today. Uh, the next video that comes out, we it will be the Selfridges video where right. we meet a lot of fabulous other youtubers yes. cannot wait for this yeah then the next one will be like pre-loved but yeah. harrods right now harrods are you looking Super. for anything in particular uh i think we're going to go to shoe heaven aren't we because i want to look are. at louboutin so kate's in white Peter. so let's Ooh, see if they've got them nice yeah how about you i am going to have a look for some low ev trainers that i've seen online that i quite like the look of and other than that, no, just having a browse. I'm looking forward to shoe heaven. No better than me. Yes. Maybe check out the Rene Calvella boots that I bought uh, yes. for matches in the yes. sale. But I had to return them because they were the wrong size. So yeah. I might try and find the right size. Okay. okay. Well, that's always good. Harris is all covered up at the minute. I'm not sure why. They must be doing something restoration wise. Mm -hmm. So um, let's head in. It's busy today. It is a Sunday. So let's head in. We have lots of Prada on display. Nice. In the window at Harrods, I love this jacket, this Prada jacket. Uh, the black skirt, the origami kind of style shoes, and the caramel bag. What a great outfit for autumn winter. Fendi. Let's take a look, see what we can find, and also Prada here. Lots from Fendi. We have the new origami tote bag, which is here in the larger sizes. We might have to try one of these on, that would be cool. We've got the shearling, the like mini origami. I like this in the black, that's nice. Uh, we have the Fendi baguette. Oh, we have a pink ostrich. That's really nice. And we've got the sequins, canvas and leather options. Oh, we've got some Fendi first. I like the pink. And the peekaboo here, also in the pink ostrich. This is such a bright fuchsia pink, which I really appreciate. What do we think to this one? Because I love it. We also have some neutrals. Here's the peekaboo. What do we think? Oh, it's so adorable. I don't have a bright pink bag either. So Nick has just told me I can join the uh, bright pink club if I get this bag. And then I'll be invited to the meetings. It's literally what he's just said. <laughs> Don't know what they talk about. Maybe the shades of pink, but I do have to say this is really nice. It is 5,000, 5,800 pounds. Really cute. <laughs> there we go. Nick has stolen the bag. It does look fab. I've got a six grand bag on my flip flops on. Amazing. Not quite my, not quite my size. It's beautiful. This outfit is lovely as well. With the pleated, I have seen these online. Like this, it looks like a, like a wrap skirt. It's cute, and they've styled this with the Fendi Come On bag in the tobacco kind of canvas. We've got lots of scarves and ponchos. Great for autumn, winter. We've got the Fendi graffiti. This is nice in the nude. See the metal Fendi on the bottom. It's really lovely and like the mini ones very cute and we also have another rather special mini peekaboo in galusha which is stingray i love that this is a neutral but it has this edgy twist prada let's take a look we have some fabulous look at this ostrich navy blue if you're into your blues i'm not so into my blue bags but i do quite like this sky blue is nice but i actually think the pink fendi peekaboo that we just saw is probably one of my favorites got some candles homeware oh nick's found the crystals 
That is so pretty. I know the lilac. Have you seen the green one as well? That is no, that's really nice. That really pops. That is stunning. It is beautiful. Not too much. It's, it's a lot, but the colour isn't like it's nice. I kind of feel like you could use it during the day as well, just to give your day outfit a little bit of a zhuzh. Yes. We have some of the double tote bag, which I love. I love the mini size here. In like the grey, and what else do we have? Oh, here's like the hoop, like hoberry style bag, and they have it in the ostrich. In the pink and the caramel. It's nice. This is nice. Look at this. Big one. Not seen this bag before. I'm not sure the name of it. This could make a nice work bag. It's got quite a few compartments. In nude. Oh, and they have like a larger size of it there lovely and in grey and caramel oh my gosh they have the pannier in like a caramel now this is cute this is i think this is the mini pannier really nice bag we have the reissue and it's like in a velvet with gold i like this for autumn winter i feel like this is one you need to see in person because of the fabric and we've got the nylon as well and some of the more padded bags and some of the like chain strap bags oh you've got like wallet on chains in the ostrich you don't usually see like the small wallet on chains in exotics so this is nice i like this in the white and we've also got the pink pretty if you don't like exotics they do have like the slightly bigger ones here as well i think these are really cute this is like the prada room of dreams look at these galleria bags This is like a pink, silver, I think I quite like the silver. Amazing. And with all these like exotics, like this ostrich, I like an ostrich at the minute in the, these are like mini sizes in green. They've also got pink, really nice. And they've got croc. I've seen this one before, the croc with like the diamonds. And how cute are these? Don't have any logo on. The logo's on the side of the bag, so much more low key. Pink, got like Himalayan style. Nearly fell backwards down the escalator. That wouldn't have been great. No, that wouldn't. I thought you dropped your phone. <laughs> no, it I'm well, glad you didn't. No, I nearly dropped myself. <laughs> um, Nick, thoughts on the pink Fendi Peak boobies? Very, very pretty, very special, yeah. very unique. Um, yes, I think uh, a good one, and the colour was gorgeous and very so saturated. Nice. Um, and you said I can join the pink meetings, the pink crew, if I get one, because I don't have I a did. bright pink bag. Yeah, I did say that. Yeah, I did. Yeah, you did. Okay. Yeah. I look forward to the meetings, maybe. <laughs> we are now going upstairs. Is it upstairs? To shoe heaven? Yeah. We're going upstairs to shoe heaven. Nick sees a stiletto, floor five at Harrods. We are here, shoe heaven. More Prada. Lots of Prada shoes. Oh, this is the origami shoe, isn't it? I think. Is that? Yeah. Lots of people are starting to like wear these. Mm. What do we think? How much are they? I love these yellow sling versions. You like the sun? Yes, the sling backs. I think these maybe go better with um, the style. Let's see the detail. Nice. Prada. Oh, and they have the other ones where they like fold. Nick has found a place he's been longing for, Le Bouton. Look at these bright bags, but these like tie wrap pink shoes are so gorgeous. A little bit of Dior, what do we have? Some green, white. Over here we have the Dior book tote. We have the Joy and some shoes. You like the blue book tote? Yeah, I think that's cute. Yeah, it's nice. I like, it. Print I like the dress as well and the skirt. The shoes are horrendous. You don't like the shoes? Yeah. No. No. Wow, check this area out, guys. We have so many nice brands. Let's have a quick look. We have some Alaya. Those are gorgeous. They're nice, with little like heart toe. They look quite comfortable. I know I'm not a kitten heel person, but I think those are beautiful. No. 825, if anyone's interested. 825 yeah. on those. Got the like leather slides and heels, mules to go with the bags. It's a nice idea. You can get the matching like colorway, gold. 
It's lovely. These look like they have like little bunny ears. And over here we have some Mac and Mac. I like these with the pink bow. They have the crystals in the bow. And the black ones. They've got flats with the crystals on as well. We have Aquazura here. Lots more crystals. These. These would be great for a wedding. Something super special. Oh, and they've got them in like gold. Oh my gosh, gold and rose gold. Oh, these. These for a special occasion. Sold. Like, if I was getting married, I think these would possibly be like a strong contender for a wedding shoe. Not so comfortable. We'd have to have flats as an alternative, but still. And all the crystals wrapped around. Oh, look at these. Do they have a price on? Uh, these ones are £965 for these. All of them very special pairs of shoes. We have Alexander Wang. We have Gina. So lots of crystals again. Crystal bags. Let's take a quick look at Gina because these are nice. I like these like mules with the crystals greens and silvers oh wouldn't these look fabulous on a beach holiday like going out for cocktails on the beach you don't want anything high you want to be quite comfy but you want to be fabulous at the same time how much are these let's take a look 845 pounds i love these because like a mermaid colorway again perfect for holidays lots of incredible sparkle and we have found the Rene Calvella because these are the boots that I ordered from mattress.com. Apart from these ones have the black crystals, I did get the gray. So here's the difference, let me show you. Here is the gray and the black for anyone that wants to see the difference. So I had the gray ones, but I would actually really like the black. And these are handmade, they're really beautiful. They've got the cream crystals. It's actually nicer in real life, the cream crystals, than online. And then they've got the caramel as well. These are lovely, but I, I got these and they were too small. So I, I'm gonna try these in, hopefully, what I think is my size should be a little bit bigger. And they've got the, like, pumps as well. And the heel version, where it goes, the snake goes all the way around really beautiful and here we go the Rene Calvella Clio boot I will link these down below with the black crystals this time I'm trying on a UK size 5 which is my usual size and I think they fit I think they'll fit nice with socks so true to size Gucci what have we got out at Gucci and we've got Saint Laurent over here so we'll take a quick look at what we can this is nice that's cute I like it in the rose pink I'm yeah, not sure the name of this really like it's grey as well yeah that's, that's nice. Really nice and the tote bag the tote bag's cute and this is cute with the um, the webbed the Gucci webbing strap yeah nice colour yeah I yeah. like that and here is the new horse fit bag I'm not sure about this guys I don't really like it <laughs> it's not very me we've got the blondie so oh we've got snake skin that's cute leather nice we've got the bamboo handle these are nice oh i like this green color very summery with the bamboo handle and they have some exotic it's like a teal exotic orange and red they're nice and some pink crystals lovely we actually have the diana bag up here in like a teal ostrich that's really lovely the Himalaya teal, Diana. that Himalaya, yeah. Look at that. Really nice. And we have some exotics. It's black crystal. This would just look so good as an evening bag. So we've got the all leather and the crystal. Nice. I think I actually prefer the crystal and it has the exotic like detail on the sides. Oh, how beautiful is that? actually really really nice oh and they've got it in like a phone holder style as well now like a little 
kind of tote bag. These will look nice crossbody. Nick, what have you got here? What have you found? A Gucci Diana, and this is in snake skin with I the, the green and then this fluorescent yellow. Doesn't this just make it? It's beautiful. You can change these and buy different colors, I think. I think they're gorgeous. They're really nice. I think the Diana is a really pretty bag. I do. Really, really nice. How nice is the Jackie bag? Thank you. I like the canvas. And these outfits. And some shoes. Mm -hmm. These are cool with the gems. That's cool. I love these. With the GGs. Yeah, they're yeah. nice. It's like Arctic mission, but make yeah. it chic. Yes, they look like uh, perfect for winter. Some marmonts. The Gucci shoes with the logo. Some shoes out. Ooh. <laughs> what have you found, Nick? I'm going to put this on. An embellished Gucci Diana in this beautiful green. Look at that. Gorge. Really nice. Give it a spin. Let's see some sparkle. Oh, and it's... <laughs> oh, it's got like lizard. So the leather, the trim oh, is lizard. Like a mock, maybe mock, I don't know. That's nice. It's no, I, pretty, th I think it? it might be real. Oh. I think it might be real. That's lovely. Oh, I love this. See, they're a bit too plain for me, but I like the style. Like, like I don't like the color combination for me personally. I prefer those, like nudes. Check these loafers out with the, the horse bit detail. I have like gems. They're really nice and they have the black. Special collection. Yes. Wow. It's very limited. Yeah. Um, so you have the hand applied crystals. So we have it this year and so beautiful. We'll have it next year. So it's very, very limited. I'm sorry. I was so, Yeah. I think it's not only beautiful. Okay. Have you been to Bond Street? Yeah. Just stopped and actually. So Nick, we finished in Shoe Heaven here at Harrods. Oh, we have finished. The, the so Kate's looked really nice on you. Oh, I love them. I yep. love them. And yeah. the Rene Carvella boobs. They would look. They looked really good. You like them? Yeah, I really like those. I think you should get them. Yeah. yeah. So this has been a successful trip. I would say so. We now know what sizes we are in things. So now we can go away, count our pennies, and maybe place some orders. Exactly. We like placing orders. We do. We've got Louis here. Let's see what's on display. Petite Mall, Twist Lock, we have the new Malatage pieces, the Cousin, some trunk bag. Oh, I'm not sure about these clogs. This is nice. It's like a crossbody bag. And we've got the small Speedy, I think this is Speedy 20, and some Pochet Matisse. Well, over here we have some really special pieces. We have obviously the Capucine. This has like a python handle, silver hardware. We have the trunk here. I've seen this one before, it's so gorgeous. We have the snow white capucine with the python. It's really nice. And the galet. I would go for the white one. And here we have the capucine with iridescent hardware. How gorgeous is that? Let me see if you can see it. That. It's really nice. And the multicolor kind of trunk. Yes, it's a little mini thing with the tag. I think that's really cute. And we have the Cousin bag in black and the white. Not sure about this one. A little bit different though, isn't it? Got the twist lock in all black, epi leather. I love the puffiness. So this is like puffy leather. And the standard one. Which one do you like? I don't even know the name of this one, but it's no, cute. No, but I think it's really, really gorgeous. I think just as a evening statement, that's really The colour looks really nice on that bag. Really lovely, it's like a peachy pink. Like iridescent almost. Yeah. And the all say in yellow. Nice. Wow, guys, look at this. Lots of the go on for my bag. And this is the first time that I have seen this pink colorway. So it's like a yellow which fades into a pink and it almost looks iridescent in real life with like a champagne light gold hardware. You can see this is the color that I've got. This is called tan. We have a brighter yellow gold on this, which I think suits the caramel tones. We have the picos in the white and the black and the kind of iridescent soft trunk and picos. 
Mexico. I like this. I've seen quite a few influencers being gifted this though. So how do we feel about that? Love it with the hound's tooth. Chanel, let's take a look. That's so cute. That's stunning. Is that a wearable? That bottle has a chain in it. Yeah. We have this pink flat bag. This looks like a seasonal style. Classic flat vibes, but not quite. We also have it in white. It feels like it has quite a chunky chain, so like the 19. And in this black, this looks like lambskin. We have the new Party Kelly bag here in pink. We have the Chanel 22 in pink in caviar leather as well. The Party Kelly, I'm not so sure I like it. Let me know what you think in the comments to this one. I really like this tote bag from Chanel. And we have another seasonal flat bag. Here we have like a round, round bag. We have quite a lot of white and black. Always great for classic items. I love this cute little white wallet on chain at the bottom of the top handle. It's like a mini business affinity kind of. Wow, this crystal, like prune, caramel, cranberry color, gorgeous. The Chanel 19 in tweed. We have the Chanel Boy in gray with champagne gold hardware. Nice combination. We have the classic flap in like the patent reds and pinks. We have some black, like we have a black maxi 19 here. We have some greys, the Chanel Deville, small size in grey, great for summer. Flat bag, some reds and blacks like saddle style. Nice colour palette. Let's see what Chanel has in the windows. Outfit here. Nice blazer, tweed. What kind of bag do we have? It's like a seasonal piece, like a wallet on chain. It's nice. Oh, we've got the slingbacks, like the shoes. What do we think to these? I don't know if I would buy a pair myself, but I do think they're nice. We have a classic flap in the pink. Lovely. And what do we have? Not, lots of nice, like ready to wear and colors. We have the one we've just seen. I actually know it's kind of like got pockets on the front. Yeah, those shoes are very questionable. You don't like the shoes. No. They're, they're a bit much for that delicate white dress, I think. They're just hideous. The belt's cute. It has like CC. Oh, nice oh, so has there been anything else that has caught your eye? No, I'm going to say, I think other than the shoes, to be honest, there's nothing. Yeah. But because we haven't quite been able to um, get to, we wanted to go and have a look at Luxury Promise. We did. But we didn't quite get that. I think I'm probably going to have a little browse online and see what see what they had. And then maybe on our yes. next trip, we can come and see what they've got in the showroom. Definitely. And that reminds me, guys. So the next video coming up, again, I'm just going to remind you, Selfridges, we're meeting lots of other YouTubers. It is going to be epic Woo. and then um, I've also got a pre-loved London shopping vlog so we weren't together at the time we but were. you can take a look at that and see what some of the stores have in yeah. stock Perfect. and you guys can as well and I cannot wait for us to go shopping let me know what you guys are liking the look of in the comments down below I'm still thinking about the pink Fendi peak but I mean, stunning. let's be real That's like gorgeous. it was it was so nice like I wasn't expecting to like it either like I just saw it and was like mm. it's really special it's it really, really special. Is. It really is. And Let that's me... what luxury is all about. It should be yeah. special and it should evoke a feeling. Yes, exactly. Exactly yeah. that. And sometimes you know. Yeah. You're just like, ooh, when okay. You know, you know. When you know, you know. Exactly. Now make sure you don't go anywhere because coming up next, I'll link my latest video release here for you and over here. We are going shopping at Selfridges. When this video is live, the video will be here. And we are going to be meeting lots of other amazing YouTubers as well as doing another luxury shopping vlog, checking out some more from our favourite luxury brands. Enjoy.